I'm so, I'm so fucking disappointed. And we were getting along perfectly fine, Mikan. We were doing it. We were doing. We were gonna be a dynamic duo. Like I said, aren't you the killer who murdered Ibuki and Hyoko? Killer? Huh? Uh, I'm the killer. What is this? Uh, hey, don't you think that's kind of impossible? I don't think it's impossible, man. But fuck. A chick like her as the killer? She couldn't even kill a fly. In fact, the fly would probably kill her first. Sh sh she's right! Uh, a clumsy slowpoke like me killing someone? That's completely out of the question! So, I guess my initial... My initial, uh... Thought was correct, where I was like, Mikan has a lot of time. Well, not a lot of time, but when her and Fuyuhiko went to search the island, Mikan would be in charge of the music venue, so it would give her time to go back to the scene of the crime. But we're the only ones. Thanks to that video, we're the only ones who have the advantage of an alibi. An alibi? Was that the killer's goal? Now that you mention it, you guys brought that up earlier. Only Hajime and Mikan have an alibi. It's just a coincidence! But you're the only one who could have filmed that video in the hospital conference room. Is that also a coincidence? <laughs> Shouldn't you get some rest already? You should be exhausted from nursing without any sleep, right? Then if you insist, I'll use the on-call room upstairs. You must be mentally exhausted, so it's better if you relax in the lobby instead. At that time, you said you were going to the on-call room, but you actually went to the conference room. <laughs> Alright, Hajime, we get it. She did it, but you ain't gotta be so fucking harsh on her about it, man. That's when you put on a hospital gown that you prepared in advance, put the bag on your head, and began filming. By doing that, you made up a video that showed Ibuki trying to hang herself at the music video. And showed that to me. <laughs> Furthermore, I saw that video at the hospital lobby. If someone wants to go to the conference room from outside, they have to pass through the lobby. So it's impossible that someone who wasn't already in the hospital went to the conference room to film. Not only that, the others in the hospital, Kane and I, were both delirious from the despair disease. So that must mean... Please, wait a second! What are you saying? I'm the killer! Beacon, I don't want to say it, but I have to. My life is on the line, damn it. It's not literally impossible. Can't you give a better defense than that? She shows she can't even do that. Hey, you sure this chick is really the killer? I'm positive, Kane. I would never dream of it if it, if she wasn't. Wrong! It's totally wrong! It's not what you think! Just like Akane said, it is really hard to tie it all together. I mean, Mikan is the killer? I agree. It is truly difficult to believe someone could be killed by such a slow-witted woman. Really, Gundam? Really? Really? Go burn in a fucking fire. That slow-witted remark is not necessary. Exactly, it wasn't necessary. Thank you. <laughs> it's fine. I've been like this for a long time. In a tournament for social punching bags, I'd easily win first place with my soft reputation. Even I can't deny that. How many times do I have to tell you? It's impossible for me to kill someone. I'm serious. Very serious. I love you, Mekon, and you make me sad because you're crying a lot, but I got... Come on, man. What do you say, Hajime? Do you still believe this woman is the killer? Yes, I fucking believe it. <laughs> Stop it! Hey, Hajime! Um... Everyone's ganging up on me. <laughs> I 
I don't hate you, Mekon, but damn it, I gotta live! Tricks aside, logic aside, really capable of doing something like this? Could it be I'm the one making the mistake? No, in fact, it'd be much easier if I was just wrong. If I have this much doubt about someone I've spent so much time with. Wait. Wait, hold up. Is this happening? Wait, is the scene being changed because I I maxed out her fucking... Her stupid, uh, not stupid, my bad. I'm sorry, that remark was uncalled for. Her fucking, uh, like, social link bullshit? Uh, can you hold on a minute? Huh? Well, I know I'm being intrusive and all, and I mean, I have no place to say this. I missed all of the critical parts, and I doubt I have anything worth saying at an important time like this. What are you saying? But still. There's definitely no way I can overlook the kill this time. Huh? I thought it was suspicious all along, from the very beginning. Investigating with the suspect in mind creates a different result than investigating with no leads. Hey, what are you trying to say? Well, thanks to that, I was able to discover a truth that nobody else knows. What? Are you serious? I've been so focused on everybody else this trial, but I guess now's a good time to say it. Alright, Komaeda. Let's see what you got. You better not have kept quiet on purpose. This isn't a game, you know. Actually, this is a game. Fuck off, Monokuma. Please don't say such controversial statements. Well, what do you know, Nagito? Well, it's nothing big, really. Only a small, decisive clue that points to the killer. Hey, that's a huge deal! A d d decisive clue? Does something like that really exist? Let's take a look, shall we? Regarding the rope Ibuki was dangling from, this rope was supplied by the supermarket, right? There weren't any ropes inside the music venue. Again with the supermarket? That place is a hot spot for criminal goods. If they got it at the supermarket, that means it was brand new, right? What's wrong with that? I want you to take a close look at this rope. And keep in mind that it's brand new. Okay. Near the middle of the rope, it's frayed, as if it was rubbed strongly. But why is it like this? The loopy Buki used to hang herself is on one end of the rope. And the part of the rope that hung from the baton lighting is on the other end. Hey, you're taking too long. What's wrong with the rope being frayed? It means... Well, from what I can infer, I think the rope was used like this. To strangle Ibuki? The killer wrapped the rope around Ibuki's neck, pulled both ends at full strength, and strangled her. Hmm. Didn't I say that during the investigation too, where I was like, is it possible that Ibuki was strangled? Oh damn. So, I thought my version was a little bit more clever, where I was like, oh she had the gullible disease, just tell her to go hang her fucking self, she'll believe something. Alright, but this one's fucked up. The center of the rope is frayed because that's the part they use to strangle Ibuki. Hold on, I've been listening to you for a while. And it sounds like you knew about this rope clue all along. What exactly did you say to me during the investigation? So this rope won't be much of a clue. <laughs> Fucking dickhead. <laughs> really? Then I might as well search in another place. Not everyone cooperates at a class trial. Those who lie and conceal the truth will obviously be here too. Just like this case is killer. I was just copying them a little bit. Huh? More importantly, what was all that about the rope? The killer strangled Ibuki. And then... And then... I finished speaking. What? Huh? How is that a decisive clue? You wanna make me fucking finish the thought? Huh? You didn't notice it. I thought I made the decisive clue very clear. Naito's words contained a decisive clue? Did they? Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, now you tell I'm going back. Hold up. So there's very much clue, and it cooperates the trial. Those who lie and conceal the truth will obviously be here too.
Maybe that's the clue. Maybe that's the clue what he just fucking said. Is that really true? Wait, is is he saying that Mekon's been hiding her true personality? Rope used for hanging. Huh. Okay. Ibuki didn't die from hanging. She was strangled to death. That's basically the same thing. Though hanging and strangling seem similar, they're very different. The scars they leave would look different too. Scars? You mean the rope burn, right? But we believed it was from a hanging. Why would that be? Did we fall for someone's lie? The body at the crime scene was hanged, you know. Obviously, we'd assume it was a hanging. The Monokuma file complicates this too. It never specified hanging or strangulation. Whoever misunderstood is to blame! Ibuki's true cause of death was strangulation. The fact is, decipher proof. Yeah. Ibuki didn't what? die from hanging. She was strangled to death. That's basically the same thing. Though hanging and strangling seem similar, they're very different. The scars they leave would look different too. Scars? You mean the rope burn, right? But we believed it was from a hanging. Why would that be? Did we fall for someone's lie? The body at the crime scene was hanged, you know. Obviously, we'd assume it was a hanging. Okay, I'm gonna go with AC temperature. Alright. I'm gonna go with that, and I'm gonna go with, uh, what Kazuichi said. Ibuki didn't die, she was strangled. That's basically the still hanging and strangling scene. The scars they leave would look to scars. You mean the rope? But we believed it was from a hanging. Why would that be? Did we fall for someone's lie? Huh? Crap! Well, I mean, the Ibuki temperature. What? She was strangled to death. Alright, what, what do I have here? Rope from hanging. Scrap thing. paper. Though hanging and strangling seem similar, they're very different. The scars they leave would look different too. Sorry, Jackie. I'm I'm just so convinced that the answer is the AC. Die from hang. She was strangled. That's basically the still hanging. So the scars they leave. Do do. Believed it was from a. Why would that be? Did we fall for someone's lie? The body at the crime scene was hanged. You know. Obviously, we'd assume it was a hanging. The Monokuma file complicates this too. It never specified hanging or strangulation. Whoever misunderstood is to blame! What the fuck? I'm just so confused right now, to be honest. I don't... Ibuki didn't die from hanging. She was strangled to death. That's what am I fucking... Scrap paper. No, Use venue curtains. Surveillance camera. Different. Temperature. Star they leave would look different too. All right, so the only two things I really see of use here is the AC and the fucking and the rope. Why would that be? Did we fall for someone's lie? The body at the crime scene was hanged, you know. Sorry for you, go. I'm just like I'm literally just testing the waters. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing anymore. She was strangled. That's basically the still hanging and straight the scars they leave. Scars. But we believed it. Why would that be? Did we fall for some? The body at the crime scene. Obviously, we did. The Monokuma file cop. It never specified hanging or strangulation. Huh. Well, I guess it's not the AC. I guess I'm just fucking stupid. Die from hanging. She was strangled to death. That's basically the same thing. Though hanging and strangling seem similar, they're very different. The scars they leave would look different too. Ah. Uh. Scars? You mean the rope burn, right? But we believed it was from a hanging. Why would that be? Did we fall for someone's lie? There we go, alright. So it was what Kazuichi said, just a different clue. So that's what happened. 
We've been falling for the killer's lie this whole time. There's something I want to ask you. There's no doubt Ibuki case of death was being hanged by this rope, right? Yes, she had no other external injuries, so there's no doubt she died from hanging herself. I see, I see. So Ibuki died by hanging herself. You said Ibuki hanged herself, but that was a complete lie, wasn't it, Mikan? That is... well... You told us the wrong cause of death. You lied, didn't you? <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> Back to this shit. Should have been able to tell the difference between hanging and strangling just by looking. You, Mikan, the ultimate nurse. Well, I also said she's the person who would understand why the temperature would affect the time of death. Please wait. But first of all, I'm not a coroner, so I don't have the medical knowledge to identify injuries like that. That's why. It's not my fault if I made a mistake. You, you were right. And you have been a great help to us so far. But even a drunk medical student can notice the difference between a hanging and strangulation. Yeah, that would be true, because wouldn't hanging just leave marks like in, fr like in the front? And strangulation would also leave marks in the back, right? I'm not taking her side or anything, but being clumsy and unskilled in this area could lead to a mistake. He's totally right! <laughs> I'm such a clumsy mess, and I got so careless! Nikon nursed me till I got better. There's no way I'm gonna doubt her. I don't wanna doubt her either, but we have to. Don't you think her devotion to nursing is what helps her draw Ibuki to her death? Huh? And if not... Her symptoms were still very serious, and caused her to believe what anybody told her. It wouldn't surprise me if she willingly followed Mikan because she was nursing her. So, so Mikan volunteered to nurse us? Because she was planning to do this all along? That's a little... Aren't you like the thief who suspects everyone else of being thieves? <laughs> I don't think she was planning to do it all along. I think it's just something that popped up in her mind where she's like, this would be so easy. I'm not a criminal. Mikan is. I mean, she's a killer, you know. You've got it all wrong. Please forgive me. I forgive you, Mikan, but still, I'm, I'm not wrong, and I know I'm not. I'm sorry, but there's no way I can forgive you. I just can't forgive this crime at all. Um, forgiveness or not... We still have not decided if Mikan is the killer. <sighs> hmm, I see. You guys are kind. Well, if that's the choice everyone makes, then the only thing I can do is back off, I guess. But is that really okay? Is that everyone's hope? Shut your fucking mouth, Komaeda. I'm getting pissed off at you. <laughs> Friggin' annoying! If you keep talking, I'm seriously gonna beat you up! I'm really, really not the killer. But you are, Mikan. You are the killer. <laughs> There's no way I'm capable of killing someone. Mikan, stop. <laughs> Please, just stop. Is that really true? Huh? <gasps> stop it already. That's enough. I can't stop. <clears throat> I don't want to do this either. Of course I don't want to do this. But I need to do this. You, you doubt your friends? That's not it. I suspect them because I want to believe them. Well, what the hell does that mean? Yeah, really, what does that mean, Hajime? I'm not on the same page as you at all right now. Um, I don't think belief and doubt are necessarily opposites. Huh? I do doubt her. But I still want to believe her. Belief lies at the heart of that conflict. Because if there's no room for doubt, then there's no reason to believe, is there? I guess that's true. D don't say deep stuff. I don't really get it. If you want to believe in someone, you need to overcome doubt first. Belief without doubt is simply a lie. Fine. Do whatever you want. I won't stop you anymore. 
Is that all you can say? Fucking excuse me? Ah, so in the end, you're all just a bunch of bullies, huh? Mikon snapped. She finally snapped. Holy shit. Justifying your actions with fancy words. M making excuses for why it's not really your fault. <laughs> Everyone always treats me like that. <laughs> always. <laughs> it's all her fault. She's the one with the problem. <laughs> I'm done with that. You hear me? I'm Hey, hey, Mikan! It's not fair. It's not fair. 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 Why won't you forgive me? If you did something wrong, you'd forgive yourself right away. What did I do? Why won't anybody forgive me? Is acting like this your strategy now? Wow, this is annoying. Plus. To be honest, I've run out of ideas. How can we get you to admit it? That's the issue. If we don't have any clues, why don't we have her give us some? Huh? I'm the same as Hajime. I don't want to doubt any of my friends. But still, the truth is one of us murdered two of our friends. That's why we gotta stick with this until the very end. So we can finally break these chains of despair. Chiaki. Hey Mikan, can I ask you one last thing? If you're not the killer, then who fabricated that video Hajime watched? Like I said, it obviously wasn't me. Can you prove it? P prove it? Wait. Do you have any proof that I'm the one who fabricated that video? Ah, that's right! Show me your proof! <laughs> because you're just assuming the video was filmed at the conference room! T -t Treating me like a killer based on an assumption! Just because I was at the hospital! <laughs> that's totally crazy! I didn't do anything wrong! Why does everybody always hate me? Please! Just forgive me already! It, is this broad really okay? She's emotionally unstable. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's kind of funny. <laughs> I'm not the killer! The video. I never filmed the video! Hmm. It seems she finally started arguing for us. Huh? But the only one who can find the hole in her argument is you, Hajime. So, I'm going to leave this to you once again. Could it be? Was this Chiaki's goal all along? She's saying everyone's fate depends on me, the only person who saw the video. You get to decide I'm the killer! Where's your proof? Please, forgive me already! I need to make up my mind. I'm the one who has to do it. I'm the one who's gonna finish this. Man, this is emotional as fuck for me. Okay. Alright. Wait, what's Mikon's account? I'm not the killer! Wait, 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 hold on. No, I didn't mean to. My bad, wrong button. There we go. Alright, uh, what the fuck is Mikon's account? Okay, right up to the announcement. Mikon was with Hajime the whole time. Afterwards, went through the hospital to track everyone and realized that Ibuki had disappeared. When she rushed out the hospital to search for Ibuki, she apparently met up with Fuyuhiko. Hmm. We can't think of anybody else other than you who could have filmed that video. Huh? Well, do you have any proof? Is the hemp bag on her head the proof? Is the hospital gown she was wearing suspicious? Or could it be the hospital slippers she had on? Ibuki and Mikon clearly have different body types. Is that really your proof? You could tell her body type under the hospital gown? Just from that video? 
Just from that camera angle? Just from that dim candlelight? There's no way you'd be able to make out her body type! So please forgive me already! Hajime, pay close attention and listen well. You're the only one who can point out the killer's mistake. What the fuck are you saying to me? I'm so confused here. Blood on souls. We can't think of anybody else other than you. Who could have filmed that video. Huh? Do you have any proof? Is the hemp bag on her head the proof? Alright, I think it might be the slippers. Is the hospital gown she was wearing suspicious? Or could it be the hospital slippers she had? What? Buki was wearing hospital shoes, right? Then the person in that video was wearing hospital shoes too. Ah. Okay. Well, shit. Rope being used. Motel room keys. Scrap thick paper. Surveillance camera unit. AC temperature. Do you have any proof? Is the hemp bag on her head the proof? Is the hospital gown she was wearing suspicious? Or could it be the hospital slippers she had on? Ibuki and Mikon clearly have different body types. Is that really your proof? You could tell her body type under the hospital gown? Just from that video? Just from that camera angle? Just from that dim candlelight? There's no way you'd be able to make out her body type! So please forgive me already! Hajime, pay close attention and listen well. I'm trying to play cool. I'm trying to listen, man. The killer's mistake. Killer's mistake. I'm not the killer! We can't think of anybody else other than you. Wait, 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 wait. Hold up. The hospital slippers she had. Ibuki and Mikon clearly. Is that really? You could tell her body type and just from that dim, just from that camera angle, just from that dim camera. The dim lighting is kind of. There's no way you'd be able to make out her body type. It seems important, but what also seems more important to me right now is um. Hajime, pay close attention. Is what Chiaki says right here. You're the only one who can point out. The oh come on, mistake. get that out of my face. Okay, killer's mistake. Got it. We can't think of anybody else other than you. Who could have filmed that video? Alright. Do you have any proof? Okay, alright, hold up. No, I think I got it now. There's one thing. You could tell her body. One thing, one thing that's been bothering me, and I think it's the camera angle. Because A. If you fucking didn't make it, how would you know about the camera angle? And on top of that, wouldn't speakers be part of the camera angle too? Pay close attention and listen well. You're the only one who can point out the killer's mistake. Right? That's your fucking mistake, Mikon. I got your number now, you you bitch. I got you. Gotcha. You can't run. You can't run. Can't hide. You won't escape. Is that really your? You could tell her body type under that just from that bit, just from that camera angle. Yep. 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 If you didn't do it, you shouldn't know what the fuck the camera angle was. Mikan, you have committed a major mistake. Mistake? Sorry, Mikan. As I said before many times, I'm the only one who saw that video. What's wrong with that? See, the reason that confused me is for some reason I thought like instead of the camera angle, I kept thinking the dim the dim lighting on the candle, and I'm like, how would you know if it's dim if you didn't light it? But fucking, but everybody knows that shit. <laughs> but I never said anything about the camera angle. So how can you say anything about the camera angle as if you saw that video yourself? The only reason Mikan knew the camera angle Hajime had seen is because you're the person who actually filmed that video. Is that right? This is your just reward. 
The more desperately you argue, the deeper you dig yourself into a hole. You lied, didn't you? Ah! Oh. Are you serious? Akane, I'm just as surprised, man. Fucking, but I knew it was gonna happen eventually. I knew it. Is it true, Mikan? Did you, did you kill Hiyoko and Ibuki? Not it. I mean, it's impossible. You're fucking crazy. And I love that. Impossible. You know that hemp bag Ibuki was wearing when she died? Try remembering the tote bag instead. Ding! I totally remember now. What the heck's wrong with her? She's getting weirder by the minute. Shut up, Kazuichi. I'm liking this. was wearing in the video how do you know so much about that video <laughs> who cares about that i care about that more importantly did you know that bag is a limited item that was sold at the movie theater hajime saw it too didn't you you remember the usami decal on it right whoopsie don't worry about it i remember even if you don't there's no mistake that that tote bag is a limited item. So don't you think it's impossible? Using one tote bag in both the conference room and the music venue at the same time? It's blatantly obvious that that's impossible. Don't you think? That's why that video isn't fabricated, and I'm not the killer. So you'll forgive me, right? Taking your stubbornness this far. Such despair. Then you're gonna forgive me? I won't stop until you forgive me! Long time no see. Well, not really. It's time for the third Panic Talk action PTA. This is probably gonna be my last job during class trial. Please humor me while I taint your ears one last time. Starting from this PTA, the reload and ammo features will be added. What? You will no longer be able to make do with just pressing X. Come on. Below the tempo meter is a low portion of the screen. Number bullets. For more... Oh, god damn it. You'll need one bullet to destroy one remark. When you're out of bullets, you won't be able to destroy the remarks no matter how much you mash X. Okay. You'll be able to refresh your bullets by... T okay. Just lock on, press the square, and time with the tempo maker. What? Wait, what? Controls are the same as X. I'm sorry, I don't speak that language. The number of bullets refreshed and bit. What the fuck was that about? <laughs> what was that about? Just went to Japanese for no fucking reason. Uh, if you get time, press. Alright. Okay. Ah. Uh. If I set it to gentle, I don't need to reload. All right, well. I'll keep explaining it until you forgive me. That bag is a limited item. <laughs> That's why that crime is impossible for anyone to pull off. I love you, waifu. I love you so much, but you're so fucking evil. Good. Will you forgive me? You'll forgive me, right? Isn't that right? You're obviously gonna forgive me, right? At this rate, we're not getting anywhere. I gotta do something to end this. I gotta do something so I can remem uh, remember. So I can make her admit it. Where the fuck did I get the word remember from? Panic talk action. You still haven't forgiven me? I'll do anything you want. Please, draw on me. Do you understand? Why only me? Please, draw on me. Can you forgive me already? Forgive me! Forgive me! Please, draw on me! Do you understand? Can you 
you forgive me already? I'll do anything you want. Can you forgive me already? Wait, what? I'll do anything you want. Wait. Oh, wait, what? Fever. Oh uh, shit, 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 shit. Uh, theater bonus prize. This is the end. I literally panicked there. <laughs> I was like, wait, what? Monokuma mentioned this earlier. When you buy one bag, wait, what? When you buy one bag, you get another one free. It's a common practice to bait customers with the bonus prize. Whoever bought that bag should have received another one as a bonus prize. Which means it's not impossible to use that bag in two separate places. So please, just stop making desperate excuses. Why? Why can't you forgive me? Why? Mikan, I can't. I can't forgive you. Well, I mean, I do forgive you, but still. Still, you killed her. You killed both of them. Desperate struggle is finally coming to an end. Why does everybody always hate me? You should just forgive me already! I don't hate you. Nikon, it's already over. After I go over your crime from the beginning and show that you have no arguments left, please just admit it already. In the end, at least let me believe in you. Okay. Okay, here's what we got. Here's what we got. See? Um... What are we doing here? Alright, I'm a little confused. No, that's not it. Here's everything that happened in this case. The key to this incident is the surveillance camera video that only I saw. That's why I'm going to start with that to unravel the knots of this crime. When I went to the hospital with Mikan this morning, I noticed a specific thing in the lobby. The incoming signal light on the surveillance monitor was blinking ahead of the scheduled time. When I switched on the monitor, what appeared on screen was a person wearing a hospital gown and a bag on their head about to hang themselves right at that moment. That surveillance camera unit was designed for two-way communication with the hospital and the music video. That's why I thought the signal originated from the music video, so I immediately headed over there. But that was the killer's trap. In truth, that video was recorded in a different place. The killer brought the music venue camera the night before and made their preparations in advance. And then, they filmed that video in the hospital conference room. By doing so, they tried to make me think the incident was happening in real time. When in fact, the crime had already been committed by that point. The person in the footage wearing the bag was actually the killer acting as a fake. I didn't know that, so I went to the music venue and found the hanged body wearing a bag on its head. Seeing the body before me, I panicked and rushed out of there to get the rest of you guys. But, that was also part of the killer's trap. After cleaning the conference room, the killer was likely watching the music venue from outside. And, as if they were switching places with me, they went inside the music venue and began working on their last trick. 
First, the killer peeled off the wallpaper covering one of the stage pillars, revealing Hyoko's body. When I first arrived and saw the hanged body, I didn't notice anything strange about that pillar. I didn't expect it to be slightly larger from the wallpaper, or have Hyoko's body hidden inside. Next, the killer destroyed the surveillance camera that was used in the conference room. After destroying it, they mixed it with what was left of the surveillance monitor found at the crime scene. The surveillance camera the killer used was originally brought from the music video, but when they brought it, they made sure to destroy its monitor beforehand. They wanted to hide the fact that the camera wasn't at the crime scene. In the end, the killer transformed the crime scene into a closed room. They broke one of the drumsticks from the storage room and placed it near the music venue's entrance. However, they did this to mislead us into believing that the music venue was locked from the inside. In actuality, the reason the music venue became a closed room was because of the glue. The killer sealed the door with glue and intentionally created a closed room that could be forced open. With that, the killer finished tampering with the crime scene and met up with Fuyuhiko and me. They helped us force open the music venue door, despite the fact that they personally sealed it. And they made us discover not just Ibuki's body, but Hyoko's suddenly present body as well. At the time, they pretended to be surprised, but inside, they were probably relieved that their plan worked out. Isn't that right, Mikan? This crime was orchestrated by you, was it? I cut him off at the end by accident, but god damn it! Now, what do you want, Monokuma? Are you gonna tell- Wait, wait, are you gonna tell me that Mekon's the traitor? Is that what's happening here? I gotta be. I guess. I guess I gotta be. It seems your arguments have reached a conclusion. So let's proceed to our regularly scheduled voting time! Now then, please pull the lever in front of you and cast your vote! Who will be chosen as the Blackened? Will you make the right choice or the dreadfully wrong one? Let's go! We're all voting for Mekon. That, that girl is crazy. But don't worry, you're still wifey. Still wifey material. <laughs> 